Some Rift Valley Governor allied to Deputy President William Root of Gons loaned their support for him just months after publicly declaring their willingness to draw their weight behind his 2022 presidential quest. Earlier this year, DP Root went on a charm offensive in the region, offering goodies to leading opposition figures who in turn changed their political positions in his favor. The move was seen as an attempt to fully lock the Rift Valley ahead of the 2022 polls. Back then, Mr. Ruto managed to convince Governors Jos Fadnanok of Turukana County, the O was for the ODM, John Lanyangapu of West Pokot was for the Kanu, Patrick Amber of Transoya was for the Ford Kenya to cross over to his camp, but no sooner they defected than they went mute. The county chiefs have since taken a low profile missing the DP's Ruto major functions in the area, quite unlike in the past when they would accompany him to whatever functions he attended. Mr. Nanok, for instance, would fly all the way from Lodi to give DP company newers in Gishu during church fundraisers and barrios. The DP reciprocated at some point by spending days in Turkana inspecting government projects and promising residents more goodies. Although Mr. Nanok has recently been slowed down by all the issues, his ebbing enthusiasm for DP Ruto's company has been noticeable. The governor has been seen with the DP only once in the past three months, that was during the year's Tobongu Lori Cultural Festival in Lodo last month. Some political pundits have blamed the warning enthusiasm to be seen with the DP route on the increasing campaign by the Kenya Revenue Authority, Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission, Directorate of the Criminal Investigations and other law enforcement agencies against public officials facing allegations of corruption and financial irregularities. Recently, KRA took Mr. Nock to task over the county government's alleged failure to remit taxes worth 455 million Kenyan shillings. Reporting for the Kenya Digital News, my name is John Matavam.